New Country Kicks 99 hanging out at the 50th CMAs in Nashville with Mr. Trent Harmon. What's up, buddy? How are you, sir? Man, if I was any better, my name would be Trent Harmon. <laughs> I don't have anything to say back to that. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, yeah, I, I appreciate it. Our that. reigning and defending American Idol, man. How yeah, was man. that ride? Um, that was a ride. That's a good word for it. Yeah. A lot of ebb and flow in that season of my life. Yeah. A lot, yeah. Of, a lot of craziness. Now, see, now that that's all done... Now you're now you're doing it. You know you you've worked that hard to get to American Idol and win American Idol, and now you're out here doing the music thing. How's what's been the biggest transition? Um, that was that was kind of it. It was um, I had a party, right? And the next morning I went to work. Yeah, that's right. You did the party I saw it ends all over the that social, night. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. The party ends that night, and um, you just kind of keep that idea. Like every morning I wake up and I just tell myself I'm way way behind. Right. And just try to catch up. Yeah, absolutely, man. Now, let's talk about it. we got the debut single. Yes, it's out at radio yes, sir, right yes, now. You've been traveling around, hitting the road. Traveling around, we're doing a radio tour. Uh, single. The single's doing really well. Yep. Uh, really well. And um, it's so good that I got to write the single oh, very that cool. I'm taking to radio. Nice. So I can talk about it. Yeah, you know? absolutely. Well, you know, the best songs, we talk about it all the time, the best songs are lived. You know what I mean? Like, you, right. you know, you can't really sing about it and put your true heart into it unless you've lived it. Um. Yeah, and I mean, the song that we had anticipated to go to, to radio with wasn't written by me. Right. It's hard to talk about the inspiration behind a song that you didn't write. You're very right. Yeah, you, true. You can't talk about a book you didn't write. Yeah, you know? amen. If you write it, you can preach on it. Yeah, you're right about that, man. Well, you know what? We're, of course, here in Nashville, 50th CMAs. If you could go back and sing one song. I've been asking everybody this tough question. Sing one song with one artist from the last 50 years on that CMA stage. Who would the artist be and what would the song be? I would sing George. Jo I'd sing with George Jones. Oh my man! And I would sing "You Stop Loving Me." Today. I think you've shut the. You, you know you, what? You turn the lights off after that. Mic yeah. drop. Yeah. You, yeah. That nobody's coming back from that. Yeah. Wow. You know what, man? I mean, midi having met George Jones, man, just such a nice guy. Really? And man, I'm telling you, that would be awesome. Unfortunately, I never got to meet the possible. Yeah. Man. He, he was. I literally. I don't. Get, I haven't been starstruck a lot in my life. But that day I was. The, the real ones make you not be able to talk. No, it was. Yeah. And, I, man, I was so sick. Mm -hmm. But I didn't tell anybody I was really? sick because I knew there was that little small chance I might get to meet George really? Jones. And I just, like, I bit the bullet and you, just powered you do, through. You do, you do. I mean, he was probably sick, too. Yeah, know? exactly. Was, so. Exactly, man. Well, Trent, so good uh, yeah, to man. meet you, man. Best of luck good on everything. Yes, sir. Look forward to seeing you around soon. Thank you.